Hey y'all, so today's Thursday. And for the first time, there is a bunch, a bunch of sunlight coming into my house. The, the last few days have just been muggy and nasty. Um, so anyways, I had started making my hash browns this morning around like nine. And then my grandfather called and was like, I need a ride to go pick up my car. Okay, so we took a quick ride. I'm back at home. Um, I made her two hash browns before we left and told her, like, let them cool off while we were gone. I think we were gone, like, just 15 minutes. And so now I'm finally going to be able to make mine. On mine, I put two of these. So um, I'm going to air fry these for six to seven minutes on each side. I also have my um, juice that I had opened up yesterday but did not get the chance to finish. So I have the rest of it that I'm gonna finish today. Um, I'm also working on finding a couple different spots. Charles called me this morning while he was on lunch break and was like, hey, when we go to Myrtle Beach, like we gotta find a Jamaican spot. So, okay, say no more, let me write that down. So I wrote that down so that I can look it up. It looks like they have like five different locations. So the one that looks like really authentic to me is um, the Scotch Bonnet Restaurant Grill or something. But um, who knows what we'll try. Like I said, we're, we're really like in for trying new foods. What we have here in our city is literally like Raisin Cane's, Popeye's, KFC. They're all three together. Um, of course, we have Starbucks. We have Dunkin'. We have BJ's, we have, which is a restaurant. We also have um, Timber, Timber Wood Grill, I think, Timber Lake, Timber Lake Grill, like one of them, whatever it's called. And then we have Wood Grill. That's really it. We have one Applebee's, we do not have Chili's, we do not have um, a Cheesecake Factory, we don't have a wing stop. none of that. We literally just got two Wawa's. All right, y'all. So, <laughs> so I am boiling some eggs for Chuck for when he gets home later. For some reason, I can't do no boiled eggs like that, you know, like as a snack. I mean, I could if I needed to, but I really don't. But in the midst of the moment, I'm gathering up all the trash. Literally, I had to go through the refrigerator and find like all of the things for trash that just need to go and it's my fresh fruit not my fresh fruit but like fruit i got from wegmans um last week i guess like you really have to get to that stuff right away otherwise yeah um just made cam a uh, turkey and ham little sandwich using the bread that we got i had found this in the cabinet i forgot i got this from um wegmans it's a multi-grain instant oatmeal with oats and um I can't, I can't pronounce it. Quin, quinoa. Quinoa. Maybe. Um, but anyways, it's almond vanilla. So I'll try that for breakfast tomorrow along with um, just some scrambled eggs. Because I said I was going to do it today, didn't do it. Let me go ahead and have a moment to sit down and shout out to you. Let me give a huge shout out. I was sitting here on my old phone, so... This is the older phone that I had just got before I got my 12. And normally when I'm watching videos, I like to always make sure that I have this phone on so that I can, you know, look go to look at my camera if I need to check the weather or go to research anything. So right now my couch is a huge disaster because I am simply coming uh, out of the woodworks with trying to plan you know like vacation and stuff so as I was sitting here on my older phone and I just like I said I wanted to give a huge shout out huge 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 shout out to the first person that ever became a member here on my channel keeping up with the Griffins thank you guys so much for just keeping up with me because it's not easy 
And when I say it's not easy, what I mean by that, I just wanted to say it's not easy, you know, keeping up with someone, their videos, keeping up with comments, all of that. Um, especially when I know that I'm not the only person that you guys are a, a member um, to their channels. I know that there are others and like I said, I have to give a huge thank you for you all first believing in me to start me off with the membership and to encourage me to explore and jump on the membership uh, to be a member of you all's channel as well. Now, when I say, and when I say that I was sitting here and I'm like, okay, we know we want to do a day trip to Charleston uh, the week that we're on vacation. So now that I have vacation booked, I am on vacation two days after 4th of July. So July 6th through whatever date it is. I think it's like 13th. So Saturday to Saturday. And I love to create memories for me and my kids, me and my family that we can always look back on. Um, which is why I went and created the Myrtle Beach book here. So this is my hardcover book that I created um, and has how many ever pages of how many ever memories we made. But I was sitting here and I'm like, okay, what does this aquarium look like? What are we doing there? Like, like I said before, I have to know everything that I'm doing. Um, I have to know exactly like what are my kids going to be able to do. So I typed in, I typed in NC Aquarium and let me get it to focus. I typed in SC Aquarium, right? I scrolled down and so, like I said, I went on here and was scrolling and not the first video, not the second video, but if you go past the shorts, the third video is keeping up with the Griffins video for the South Carolina Aquarium, Aquarium Walkthrough, Charleston, South Carolina. Okay. Well, you just gave me a 30, a 20 minute video to go and watch that I have not even seen. And this must have been after the fact that I joined their channel um, and subscribed last year. Because when I say I'm going to sit here and watch this 20 minute video, I am. I want to see what we're going to do, what the kids get to do, what is in store for all of us, how long I can anticipate us staying. And then, of course, I want to go to Folly Beach after visiting this aquarium. So I have found somewhere to eat there. But I love to know what we're going to do before we get there. Exactly. Watched it from beginning to the end. All right, y'all. Um, so I finally broke down and I'm making myself a ham sandwich. And I'm gonna have a bag of Doritos with mine. And then I have my ice cream that I got yesterday from Baskin Robbins still here, because I didn't eat it. I bought it home and put it in the freezer. So I'll just let that thaw for a little bit while I eat. And of course, while I wait for my food to digest. Well, y'all, I started Empire back. All right, y'all, so I'm not doing anything else the rest of the evening. I'm gonna get ready to go over here, wash these dishes really quickly. Y'all look at my head. Wash these dishes really quickly. And then um, I'm just gonna find me something to watch on TV. I did start watching Empire, but that's something that I'll watch in the evenings when Charles is not here, because he really wasn't into Empire. And then I'll watch it like on the weekends when it's just me over here and like most of the time Charles is over there on his game and TV so I ain't gotta worry about him but I'm gonna sit down and do some more planning for Virgin Virginia Beach I ain't been to Virginia Beach in years um, I'm gonna do some more planning for 
Myrtle Beach and then eventually get ready to fix some dinner and get ready to get these kids in the shower and call it a night. Hey y'all, it's 6.42. I had to head out because I needed to drop some stuff off to Goodwill and take trash, but I decided that I'll just do the Goodwill stuff Saturday as I head out um, to Skyler's soccer game, right? So what I'm gonna do now is I need gas in my car, but that way I don't have to try to get it tomorrow or Friday. Um, I should have gotten it this morning before I went back home. I just didn't care. Um, so, I'm going to get some gas first. And then I'm going to go to Dunkin's. Grab me an iced coffee. Charles is like, I don't want one. Because we just had some chicken sliders. They're like the little Tyson ones here. They're actually really, really good. You can make um, two sandwiches at a time. And I eat mine with some sweet and sour sauce from um, McDonald's because I didn't have any Polynesian sauce. I did. It's in the car. You know what? Whatever. I need to take this sauce out of here and take it in the house because Sky has been bugging me about Polynesian sauce. But I blame it on my best friend for putting us onto the Polynesian sauce because it's good. <laughs> so, Cab, shame on you. Um, anyways, after I get some um, iced coffee from Duncan. I'm gonna run into CVS really quickly and then I am going to dump the trash and come right on back home. I am gonna enjoy the rest of my evening. Me and Charles are talking about like our plans for vacation. I'm still trying to put everything together um, with like where everything is mapped out. And then um, eventually, eventually do nothing. I'm gonna have to start laundry tomorrow morning because normally it's Thursdays for me. I gotta get back on the routine of getting my clothes washed and going um, because next week it's a full week. My favorite spot. Mm, I'm at my favorite spot on the dot. I got a real pretty little coffee that's waiting for me. <laughs> Cause I done pulled up. I'm anticipating French vanilla. Y'all know Adele is like my, my third ego. My second ego is Whitney. <laughs> Don't get me started. 